So Bitcoin has just seen another massive move to the upside and in today's video I'm going to be reviewing this rise, why it has happened and uh, you know where my targets are for this going forwards uh, and I will be discussing the correlation between Litecoin and Bitcoin which has just been so perfect. So I hope that you thoroughly enjoyed this video, that you are very well and uh, yeah let's just go straight into this Bitcoin move. Um, so I'll give you obviously, so from the last video, the update that I done which was now tw two days ago, so two days ago I gave that update setting off that potential of the bear flag to come down into my buy zone of this order block and I'll explain what an order block is in a second because I had some questions uh, but obviously in that last video how perfectly did this play out by the way we literally had that bear flag and dropped straight down into that order block okay so that was uh, v very pleasing and uh, you know when we come down to the one hour okay when we come down to the one hour what we can see here Okay, firstly, let me explain what this order block is because I had a lot of questions. The order block basically is this red candle prior to a, you know, a big move to the upside. Okay, so this is where one would expect to find support. Um, specifically, you want to see it come in on the 0.5. Okay, and this is where, as my group will uh, back me up, I had heavy bids, heavy big bids on this 0.5 of the order block because for me, there was confluence there with this Gartley harmonic. Okay, you had the Gartley harmonic pattern going on and you had the order block of 0.5 and just this 9K region had really really big support and uh you know this <laughs> has obviously now made for a very 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 nice buy okay and then we obviously have our low high higher low higher high so back to the one hour bullish market structure that's what i want to see so really great that we got that follow through and uh yeah that's made some for some very happy traders um uh, so yeah, where are we finding resistance right now? No, let, let me talk about this Litecoin correlation because this Litecoin correlation has just been insane, uh, really, really nice, and it all stemmed. Okay, so it all stemmed, and this was one that I gave freely for everybody. Uh, all stemmed from the weekly reclaim of Litecoin. So obviously, you were coming up to resistance on Litecoin of this weekly level. OK, and you start forming an ascending triangle below resistance, consolidation under resistance. Bam, you go straight through it. Very, 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 very nice. Uh, so obviously you consolidate in here, you break the weekly, you back test. OK, the old resistance, you back test it as support, specifically the weekly and, you know, the continuation here to the upside. This was one that I posted on Twitter and it just literally took off, literally took off. Um, held the monthly and then you move up again and what was interesting for me really really interesting was that today bitcoin obviously had a bit of a move to the downside but litecoin held its own really well so you can see bitcoin lost intraday support only intraday support it lost lost the intraday support but litecoin did not okay so litecoin held up really nicely okay so litecoin literally held up really nicely held that monthly didn't even come down and touch it. That's how strong it was. And, uh, you know, so that was like a sign. OK, Litecoin has held up really, really well here. And with the same, Bitcoin obviously got the continuation follow up move. Um, perfect, perfect, perfect. So, you know, this is the situation that you're in now. Obviously, if you had bought that uh, order block with me, you're now just sat uh, thinking, yeah, life is good. <laughs> but if you're not, you obviously are wanting to get in on a retracement, okay? If you are wanting to get in on a retracement because you didn't buy this dip, you didn't buy down here, you know, not everybody can. People are not at a computer. You know, everybody has their own story. But, uh, you know, what you're looking for is you're going to be wanting to get on not financial advice i'm not a financial advisor but obviously if you're wanting to look to buy in well logical places to buy in for example are going to be on pullbacks to you know important support levels okay where you'd be wanting to see continuation in the form of a bull flag okay uh, alternatively if you are looking uh, for a more bearish scenario then obviously you could just say well there's <laughs> I, I feel sorry for the bears, but uh, you know, here you could just say, well, here, here's a move up. We're going to be moving back down for another leg. And in, in fact, you're just wanting to short this move up straight away. OK, I'm not saying, by the way, that that's not an insult to anybody that's been shorting or longing. You know, I literally don't care uh, whether you're a bull or a bear. Really, I honestly don't have any care in the world. But uh, all I'm saying is that is a, a, a is a strong reaction, just like we saw last time at, at the 382, the overall 382. We got a strong reaction. That is a pretty strong reaction. Uh, but yes, I'm. Uh, you know, you do need to be aware. It is at the moment lower highs coming in. So obviously, bulls, uh, sorry, bears are really want to gonna defend that that weekly level, uh, so they can try and get some continuation to the downside. Obviously, that was our three eight two overall uh, defense, and then you can see from the highs, uh, sorry, from the highs up here down to the lows down here, you can see you're getting rejected currently from the three eight two. So uh, you know bears although weakened have still got the higher the uh, lower highs coming in here on the 382 
Okay, so I think the monthly is going to be a crucial defense, okay, crucial defending level. Uh, and on the flip side, obviously, you can take your fibs from low to high um, and say that you've got some important support down at the, 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 the basically the 10k, where obviously you got sl slightly rejected from the 10k this morning, come back down all the way to 9.3, a follow up to 9.6. So you, one would imagine this 10k again is going to be important support if you come down that far, okay. Um, but yeah, basically that's a really nice reaction, really nice follow up, and uh, yeah, this this was this was brilliant. Okay, so obviously I was giving out that 0.5 order block in in the group along with Litecoin, and uh, you know people are so happy. I love it. I absolutely love it. Like this makes me so so happy. Like people making money off of my uh, technical analysis, I guess. And uh, yeah, this is just. Love it, love it, and uh, this guy paid for his wife's shopping spree, shop, shop, <laughs> shopping spree off of that Litecoin call. So all's good, all's good when you can, when when you can make your make your family happy with those sort of calls. Um, so yeah, very nice. And as you can see here, getting some rejection wicks, okay, off of that 382 resistance, aren't you? So that, that's an important, yeah, an important metric to be aware of right there. Um, so yeah, like just to calm down and explain everything to you, like what I would be saying is is really keep your eye on that weekly resistance. A close above that per, would be so nice, okay. But alternatively, if you're looking for this for a, a drop to the downside, keep your eye on 10k to 10.3, okay. Those are going to be some important supports uh, coming into the week ahead, uh, specifically the weekly close. I think this is going to be a very important weekly close. Nice reaction, but you do want to take the highs here. Okay, so really that weekly. Um, so, you know, obviously altcoins, and they were starting to look nice, but uh, as you can see, the majority absolutely destroyed. You've got NEO doing well. You've got uh, Litecoin obviously doing pretty well. Okay, no. So, yeah, Litecoin pretty decent. Um, NEO pretty decent, although a rejection from the 114 fib here and uh, nevertheless still pretty decent on the day and uh xlm xlm was absolutely hilarious it had the binance news of that they're supporting the airdrop and it's given it all back look at this pump on the news and full-on dump following that so uh yeah there you go well played binance well played xlm um so yeah that that's all that's what i'm looking at here okay try and see if, if we can start to hold the monthly if, if you actually fall down and, and reject from the monthly then that's obviously you're looking down towards lower levels so um yeah really keep your eye on monthly and obviously we have to we have to acknowledge the if we do actually move up again to 618 of this move okay so do not forget to acknowledge that 618 sat around 11,600 that region 116 is going to be pretty big uh of the, obviously the 618 uh well golden pocket region so those are the key levels that i will be looking at and uh yeah i'm just I'm absolutely loving, 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 loving trading Bitcoin. Uh, obviously, I took like that week off, come back yesterday and uh, yeah, come back and seeing this again. It, pff, how can you not love Bitcoin? How can you not love trading? Just as, as I made this tweet today, where's that tweet that I put out today? Uh, yeah, <laughs> if you don't like trading, we cannot be friends. This literally makes me the happiest person in the world. The rewards one gets for putting in the time and being correct is literally a drug for me. Uh, like, high off of trading right here i absolutely love trading i i really do so um yeah thank you everybody uh for all the support hope that you've thoroughly enjoyed this video if you have please give me a like that's always appreciated and uh yeah obviously family update side things are okay are, are going well there they're back at home so you know i'm happy about this i'm happy about life in general right now uh especially with trading it's it's you know things are looking up things are looking good so um yeah thanks for the support look at this so you are getting this rejection weight this is something to be aware of but just keep your eye on those support levels as mentioned uh you know it's the sort of traders that turn extremely bearish down here that get absolutely wrecked uh just as like you know it's all about your thought you have to look at the sentiment of the market and uh you know you see such a massive move to the downside you you have to be expecting some sort of reaction and relief bounce out at the very least don't you so uh yeah no that's how trading goes just just uh that's all I'm going to say. So I hope that you've enjoyed this. Thank you, everybody, so much. And I will catch you in the next videos. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Have a brilliant evening and enjoy trading this absolutely beast of a coin, which is Bitcoin. Thank you, everybody. Cheers. Good night. Bye.